Since the legalization of marijuana, Denver is seeing a rise in homelessness. And our next guest says that's coming with a high price. Yeah, an informal survey of 500 new faces at the Denver Salvation Army Crossroads Shelter found that 30 percent moved to Denver to take advantage of their pot laws. So how is this affecting Colorado's government? Let's ask State Senator Ted Harvey. Good morning, Ted. Good morning, everybody. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. I can imagine that this is a big burden on the state of Colorado and completely unintended consequences. Well, without a doubt, it was unintended. Who would have ever guessed that this would have been one of the issues that would have arisen because of the passage of recreational marijuana? But it certainly has been the case, and it's having an impact on all of our social services across the state and at the municipal level when you have 30 percent increase in homelessness because of uh, legalizing marijuana. So it's an interesting unintended consequence that I certainly never thought about. Well, it's known that homeless people will flock to, to states and communities that have good social programs for them where they're going to be getting benefits. Um, so what do you think needs to happen as far as this marijuana law goes to, to try to combat this? Well, this will be interesting. Um, Denver is definitely a generous city when it comes to dealing with the homelessness. So we have people coming from all over the country and the, the West coming to Denver. And now this is just one other additional benefit, if you will, for people who um, are coming to Colorado simply for marijuana. And it's going to have an impact on, on our social services. And I don't know what we do about it. I think that if Colorado is going to continue to be one of the only states in the country that has legalized recreational marijuana, we're going to continue to have the effects of people that are drawn here simply for that reason, not for um, to come here because of the skiing, the great skiing the great recreational activities that we have in Colorado, but they're coming here simply to utilize the, the legalization of recreational marijuana, that's going to have an impact on our state. And I don't know what we do with that, shy of going back and asking the voters to repeal the law or other states passing um, similar legislation that will attract people to go to those states. So it'll be interesting to see how we as a society here in Colorado and as a nation deal with this societal change with uh, respect to um, people being willing to vote for recreational marijuana. Right, right, because of course you can't say recreational use of marijuana is fine for some populations if you have a job and a place to live, but if not, I mean, what do you do with it? Exactly. Repeal the whole thing? Yeah, it's obviously a brave new world in this uh, unfolding in ways that none of us ever imagined. Ted Harvey, thank you very much for getting up and joining right. us this morning. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Appreciate it.